Ooh, we're in portal. on the map? I don't think so. Ooh, there's something cool off in this direction. Oh. Hello? Hello? Uh, but I'm gonna get in the boat. Oh, it can fly. That's great. Um, what's your what's your name? Can you play signs? Or um I don't know what's what's your name? No, you can't play signs. Do 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 do. All right. Well, you know the song of the people, so you can't be a threat. Bonbon says hi. I didn't like that you pulled out another right sword. Please don't pull a sword in my child. <laughs> oh, shoot. Yeah, there you go. Thank you, Bonbon. with us right now. Uh. Yeah, what the hell? What the hell was that? Hey guys, so I have the footage from the first time everyone met Bubbles, but the audio is unrecoverable. I'm too quiet, everything is too loud, and I can't fix it. Plus, some stuff is outdated, server info, like the nether was supposed to open on March 20th, 2024, but we're now in May and it's still not open. That's not because of poor management, but instead because sometime after the events of this video, ownership was given to two amazing friends of mine and lots of changes were made to the lore. For the most part, everything you've seen up until now was just the very tip of the iceberg, and now you're going to see some consistency in lore and you'll have an actual story to follow. So, an unnamed entity showed up wearing an iron helmet. It spoke in signs like the eggs, but only in gibberish at first, and then it learned speech from the other eggs. Uh, it wanted to be friends with the eggs, but that made us, the players, incredibly uneasy. When we tried to get all the eggs to a safe space, it followed them there and continued to torment the players. It eventually gave itself the name Bubbles, referring to the bubble blower it would hold. The one thing that would freak me out is it would blow bubbles all over the kids. <laughs> Yuck. Bubbles would regularly cause havoc, use Lunay's signs to communicate, and they would be mean to players, but an angel to the kids. Another entity showed up and communicated through brown signs instead of white signs. This entity seemed to be trying to keep Bubbles in line, at least somewhat, and seemed to be significantly less of a threat. It was almost trying to help the players. We called this entity Brown Sign, and the entity eventually donned a netherite helmet. It is unsure if this means Brown Sign is stronger than Bubbles, but Brown Sign can be seen attempting to attack Bubbles but with no luck. In the days that followed, Bubbles showed up more and more, and Brown Sign was nowhere to be seen. Bubbles even took Luna, Mast's egg, right in front of us, and there was nothing we could do. Rari went missing around this time, along with Ender, and an egg named Melody, who is no longer on the server. No one has any idea where they are, and we don't know when they'll be back. With eggs and people going missing, the future is uncertain. How will the players handle kidnappings at such an extreme extent? We'll see next time on Corian SMP. But now, the immediate aftermath of Luna being taken and Rari going missing.
Fairy tale characters. Oh shit. <laughs> we swear around the kids all the time. They're used to it. Yeah. Stars! Hey, Star. Star. You What's have up? to talk um, to me, right? Yeah. Let's go do that. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Where we Slap you, like Stamman! Jesus Christ. Here I go! <laughs> Let's, let's let's get the fuck out of here. I just ah! want to... <laughs> Okay, that didn't hurt that bad. I just <laughs> I just wanted to take you out with the slappy salmon and get you in the water so we can get the fuck out. Damn. What did you want to talk to me about? Um well I was you know like like how could <laughs> It's stupid because like I'm checking to see if you're okay, but obviously you wouldn't be okay. Um I mean, I'm I'm trying to laugh to hide everything that's going on right now. I do appreciate you actually coming to like stop by and check up on me because like I don't really have that many people that can do that. What was that about anyway? What did I walk in on? Um, that person, that Maggie person, apparently that's Ender's friend from like a long, long time ago, five hundred years to be exact. Fun. Apparently they're a fairy godmother, and they've met Snow White and Seven Dwarves and Rumpelstiltskin and Midas, that guy with the gold touch thing. Now I'm taking care of Xylon. Xylon is somebody that I'm taking care of now. Um, I don't know what's happened, but um, I might know how to get to them. I just have to talk to another entity about it. Oh. He currently resides in my mind, though. What What does that mean? I made a business deal a long time ago. You did you know not I... make a deal with the entity. I made a deal with an entity a long time ago, oh. or a business demon a long time ago, that we would be a part of the same body, and I would be in control of everything. But he could live there. So I have a curse, and it's, a, it's going into a lot of backs... It's going into a lot of my history and everything like that. So we should talk about it in clo in behind closed doors because I've got secrets to tell you Let's, that I cannot uh, tell Ender. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. Um I um dropped something off at your your house, but you weren't you weren't there. So. Thank you. I appreciate that. What did you drop off at my place? Uh you'll see. Ooh. Spooky. I like that. Right. Bro like your... is sprinting to my house. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so what's up? Why are you perched? Um <laughs> No, um so I talked to Ender a little bit. He knows a little bit about um the entity that resides in my uh my head he's not he's dangerous that that's one thing i've got a lot of like secrets i don't know are you the secret person do you um i i don't usually like talk about secrets to really any person but um do I'm i are you, a lot. are you asking do i have secrets or do i like share do you, my secrets do you keep secrets not normally Secret secrets, uh, tell no one secret secrets, hurt someone. Okay. 
if you can keep the secret or a couple of my secrets between you and me. Oh, I I am trust me, I am the best secret keeper you have ever met. I promise. Oh, that's great. I'm the best secret keeper you have ever met. I I can tell you um that right I I don't remember having a family from my past. I, I don't remember ever having a brother. I don't the only brother that I actually do have he he's somewhere else. But I only remember actually ever having well technically he's blood related because we've made a pact, but that that that's okay. Like a friend pact, you know, that we became brothers by. I didn't know I had any other relatives. Like I had no idea that I had because I, I don't know where I come from, right? Like, obviously, I don't know where I where I lived. I don't know who my family is. I don't know any of that thing. But then somehow, all of a sudden, I have a brother that I had no idea about. I have a child, and I have a sister, and, like... Is it just, like... All my memories originally where I originated and originally came from are gone, so I could have I could have had family, but I just don't know if that's them. It could be. I'm not sure, but it has to be since they're saying that I have family. I mean So it's really hard to say. You're looking at the embodiment of uh lack of humanity like i don't like, i've seen i've seen the I, world i've seen the world as it is i've been to different dimensions you're not the strangest thing that i've seen no that's not what i'm trying to say like i oh. i didn't know what a family was when i touched down on the overworld i and then you're a part of ours now I guess. I, I, I'd like to be. I, um, I don't know. I, I don't... Like, I, I seem to be taking care of Bon Bon just fine, but they've, well, then. they've got their own stuff. You know, um, I can't... If we, if we both don't know what a family is and what, what a family actually means, I'll bring you into this one. Do that family. A family means taking care of other, other people, and that that means that, well, of course. I mean, I talk to you almost on the regular basis. You talk to me almost on the regular basis. You talk to Ender almost on the reg. You, you know, so on and so forth. It doesn't matter. What matters, I guess, I just don't know what a family is, and I'd be happy to have one. I mean, you you do have one. Um, not that I remember. That's a secret. Can't tell anybody or forget things because I didn't know I had one. But you can now be a part of this family. This, You'll you, start learning. You have you feelings. have no idea how much this how much this means to me. I've never belonged before. Oh, I know. I like. I've never belonged either. But I, I would like you to feel like you belong here. So yeah. now you belong. I'd, I'd like that. Well, it's. I'm glad you are. You are very welcome to the family. Whenever you always can hang out with me. You always can hang out with Ender. You've always been there. No, but you're going to learn a lot of things that I didn't know that I had either. Number one is feelings, and they suck because I don't, I'm not used to those either. Trust me. Um, from what I've seen, I've, I've lost so much that I can even count. So losing Luna just it made me feel like I had to get them back no matter what I, no matter what. So what I plan on doing it, couple things too that thing I have to watch the kids 
<laughs> I love them. Uh, oh my god. Oh, the lag. Oh no. Okay, I'm okay. Yeah, there's a lot of signs oh, in the kids' menu. Yeah, the kids are, um... I'm, I'm watching the good. kids. Yeah, we had a we had a talk. Um, so stars is now part of our family. I, uh, that's stars. Uh, they're a star. Hi. Oh. Yeah, part of our family now, I guess. Where do you fit in? How old are you? Wait. Oh, look at you. Oh, Where do you fit You're in? So pretty. What, what do you? What, oh, thank you. Thank you. They so okay, belong. mask. They belong with us now. Sorry, I'm kind of a star geek. Usually, all the people in my stories wish upon stars. So it's so nice to finally see one in person that isn't in a rush. A whole bit of popcorn. You guys always <laughs> seem to have somewhere to go. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. That, that was just really nice. Thank you. All right, but um, yeah. Can you you two watch the kids while me and Maggie? Catch up a little bit. I usually only give these to the kids, but you know. Oh, enjoy. You're welcome. One of those kids has a sharpness 125 cat plushie, so be careful. Oh, yeah. Uh, right. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Oh, I'll, I'll be sure to get down. I will be yeah. very times. careful. Please. Oh, hi. Yeah, that, that, no. that baby's oh. arm in danger. So let's leave. Yeah, let's, let's get the fuck out of here. So, um, you better be paying me for this, Ender. Yeah, I got I just you. Gave you I leave you some money. Tom normally works. Evil streamer. <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid. Yeah. Ah! There's so many doggies. His bank information. You don't know. <laughs> Let's go home, boys.